sexy, sexy, glamorous, glamorous, fabulous, fabulous, stylist to the stars, stylist to the stars, into the draw. Touch ups with Tula, where we tell you what's best for you. Now, today we're going to be touching up the fabulously, gorgeously sexy, all round entertainer, Tony Goldsmith. And I cannot wait to let's see. Oh, there she is! That's, oh my god, hello, Toddy. Hello, <gasps> Look how gorgeous you are. <laughs> you know what I love about Toddy? She's just naturally beautiful. But, darling, today I've brought my stylist to the stars. There's Bronnie and Hi. Magic Mike. Hello. Hello. Nothing to worry about, darling. It's okay. not going to hurt a bit. So Thanks don't worry. So. They're just going to touch you up a little bit. Okay, I like being touched up. what's important <laughs> is looking good in this world, isn't it? <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, now, darling, you are so multi-talented. I can't believe it. I tell you what, I really love that show you did called Sex Life. Well, we talked about it. It was very controversial at the time. Nowadays, it would just be bland, but we talked about it. Everything from sexual position Ooh. to midlife crisis. What position do you like, darling? <laughs> um, all of the above. <laughs> Ooh. Do you, you like dressing up? Well, clearly, because I'm just going along oh. with this. No, I do. I love all oh, sexually. Mm. Sure, why not? Why not? <laughs> And you were in the Shantuzies and now you're in the Toosies. Yeah, well, the Shantuzies were, we did pretty well back in the late 80s, early 90s. And Eve, who was in the Shantuzies, and I have reformed a band and we play a lot of corporate work and we've done quite a few live gigs. Oh, that's public. fantastic. Yeah. We have to come and see you in Boogie. <laughs> you have to. Now, I heard a little story that you passed Jeffrey Rush. Well, I have had a pash with Mr. Rush. I did um, Brian Brown's Twisted Tales and he was my first on-screen pash ever. And he was so cute because I'd never done one. I said, what do you do? Do you like practice? And he ah! said, no, just we'll do it on the take and go with Ooh, it. Well, he's an expert. <laughs> so, and I said, what about the tongues? And he said, ah! no, no tongues. I love so. the tongues, darling. <laughs> what about sex scenes? Have you done sex scenes? Yeah, I've done sex scenes. Woo! Um, I did Vince Colosimo. That oh, was you quite did? hot. And Ooh, I'd love to have a sex scene with him. <laughs> I bet you would. Especially that his wife Jane was um, also in the show. It was called Life, and she was playing his wife, and I played his mistress. So it was a bit. Oh, did she scratch her eyes up? Darling? <laughs> she didn't. She wasn't on set that day. I think they probably scheduled it so she wasn't around that day. Oh, that's <laughs> a good idea. Isn't it? <laughs> and I've done a few actually. I've sort of entered into this age group in my 40s where I'm the MILF and I'm having affairs with younger men and whatever. Oh, I so love that. We love the of, younger men, A lot of we? sex scenes now. Yeah. I want to hear too about Neighbours. Tell yes. me about that character. Oh, well, she was um, your typical narcissist. She was, Ooh, like everything that, was we? out for what she got. She had blinkers on with how her actions would affect anybody else. She was a go-getter. She wanted a guy to look after her. That was the end. And she used her children to get through all sorts of things. She was a nut job, but yeah. uh, yes, but we love it, don't love, we? Was, she believed that everything she was doing was fine. She was completely like, "What's wrong with all of you?" Exactly. And got run out of town, which was a lot of fun. I loved it actually. So tell me, tell me a little secret. What's your favourite character that you've ever played? Janet in the Rocky Horror Show. I did the Ooh, I did the Peter Brook production. Horror <laughs> show. I love playing Janet. I love it oh, so much. Oh, that's great. Thank you. Oh, Toddy. Now, darling, I want to ask you a really serious question. Mm -hmm. What do you think when you see fat people? No one looked after you when you were younger. They should have taught you how to eat properly. And it must be difficult to get around every day with a lot of weight on and on your bones and on difficult for your life and it's it's a shame. Well you know what I think darling? What? I think I see a fat person and I think my god that is, that is a heart attack waiting to happen. Yeah I know. And you know when I go to Gloria Jeans or somewhere like a coffee shop mm -hmm. and there's a fat person <laughs> and they're ordering something with a whole lot of cream on it mm. I think you can't afford to have that. I mean, no. that is terrible. No, but they're trapped in this whole thing, and it's it is. It's really sad, and I think it's very you sad. can't. I don't believe there's such a thing as fat and happy. I think that that's an no. absolute myth. You no, can't no, be. No. It's hard enough getting through life anyway than carrying around a whole lot of weight. Because life's know. not easy all How the time. Exhausting. Anyway, you have to get rid of it, darling. Oh, oh but look, you look gorgeous. And thank you. Now, thank you. Stylist, tell me, what have you done? What have you done? <laughs> Well, today I've 
I've got a gorgeous shakuhachi dress on, Tony, <gasps> and then I've matched it with some fabulous Dolce & Gabbana shoes. Oh! And then just added a little bit of bling over here with this gorgeous ring. And I can tell you, it wasn't too hard to make Toddy look fabulous. She's already gorgeous. And magic mine. Okay, now because Toddy's got such beautiful long hair, we've gone for this Audrey Hepburn sort of messy French roll. So we've whipped it up on the sides, pinned it up at the back and made a little escargo and then finished it off with some um, hair framing her face <laughs> to just match everything that we've done today. Oh, fantastic, my gorgeous stylist. Now we're going to see you very, very soon in Underbelly. The oh, telling yeah. movie that's coming out called Infiltration. Oh, what are you going to infiltrate, darling? Well, I it's... won't even go there. No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for oh, having us. Thank you for popping in. in. It's been I'm lots sorry, of fun. you know, we just burst in on you. But there you have it. She looks absolutely gorgeous. And thank that's you. what's important in this world, isn't it, darlings? So that's all we have for you today. And remember, stay beautiful. <laughs> stay beautiful. <laughs>